Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. It's Bigger Booze Fort. So, you know the name of the boss already. <laughs> it's a boo! Hey. They're very shy. And they're incredibly cute in this game, by the way. <laughs> like, even cuter than normal, perhaps. Alright, going on. I mean, moving on. There's little boo, there's regular boo. It's a boo brigade. And it's not that difficult. <laughs> just, just gotta lead them around and jump over them, or lead them up to a high spot and run under them. It's, it's Boo 101. Um, I don't want to go in there just yet. I want to go. I mean, I want. I don't want to hit that bubble just yet. I want to go here. Now, what you gotta do to hurt them is you gotta hit them while they're, while they're. Yeah, if you shoot them when they're backs, I mean when they're all shy, the egg will go right through them, but when they're trying to attack you, when your back is turned, they'll uh, be able to be popped by an egg. So, uh, so, I'll show that again here really quick, because I'll be able to get an extra egg. So yeah, I'm, I'm facing this one, egg goes right through it. <laughs> but, so yeah, that's what you gotta do, the, the ricochet shot there, to actually do any damage to them. Alright, so that's out of the way, we can now pop this open, and this is why I did this at- Oh, I thought it was gonna actually block my way, but I was gonna say that's, that's why I did it afterwards, because I figured- Wait, hold on a sec. Did, did you just jiggle jiggle on the wall when I was shooting straight up? I don't know how you did that egg, but you did that egg. Wait, I bet there's a secret. No secret. <laughs> um, this you have to get from the other side, because I can't push it. Uh, from that side and be able to jump at it, I um, mean, jump to it from up top. Um, I'm just gonna take a look-see around here before I do anything rash. Because, uh, yeah, see, there's, there's that pipe that leads to it up there. And this blocks off that over there. See, that's actually the way you want to go. But because of the way that you have to use the stairs to get up here, there's no way to actually go and get that without actually... Um, using the proper methods. The same with this over here, because uh, there's this switch over here, but you'll automatically be... <laughs> so instead, what I want you to do is go over here and get that key, and then go back over to the key door. Hey, ghostly shy guys. Spooky. Spooky. I don't know why I keep filling up on eggs, but anyway, the, the key to doing this is to use your key and go through that door. <laughs> what this will do is it'll sort of kind of allow you to reset the order of things, I guess you could say, of that stair staircase getting in your way and stuff. So, yeah. You'll see when we get into it. I think that's a red coin that he's hiding over there, if I recall. Oh, nope, it's not. <laughs> and it, it was not worth the hits whatsoever. Um... And this pipe leads to where that crate was, so I don't want to take that just yet. I just want to take a look-see around here and collect everything that I can possibly collect. By the way, you can get all the boos just like grouped up in one big boo mass just by kind of overlapping them like this. Yeah, so that kind of takes them out of the equation quite a bit. <laughs> so I, I really didn't have to be as aggressive as I was to get that coin behind that other boo. But, yeah. Alright, so now that what they want you to do here is push this off, and then ground pound it over here if you want to get its contents. Because you wouldn't be able to do it over there, because all you would do is you would push it up against the wall, and then you wouldn't be able to get past the creep because of the, you'd bonk, bonk your head on that. So, yeah. Alright, so we went through that door before, and now, since the stairs aren't there because we despawned them properly, Midpoint! Yes! Yes! Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> oh, yes, you do, I guess. Oh, yes, you do, I guess. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're still good. Any secrets? No secrets? Okay. <laughs> Moving on to the next part. By the way, these blocks move a whole lot smoother in the SNES version, but they're just as functional in this version. Uh, I don't know why they're not as smooth here, but they aren't. And you can play good old jump rope with the fire bars if you're good with your timing. <laughs> uh, oh, this is just like a surfing tutorial. You gotta go on the back of the, uh... Yeah, go, on, go slightly on the back of this. 
and you'll be able to catch a wave. <laughs> a wave of lava. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how it doesn't burn, because it looks like it's made of wood, but it doesn't. Um, hopefully, I've been getting everything up to this point. Uh, got a one up, plus got a couple red coins. Now, obviously, what they want me to do here is just kill off the booze with my eggs. Oh, I got them all. Awesome. What they want me to do is kill off the booze with my eggs, but... What? Well, I'm, I'm kind of conserving them. <laughs> okay, so where is that secret pathway? I think it was up there, actually. Oh, this one has baby booze just attached to them. Yeah, there's our secret pathway. Remember that? From the, um, Bert the Bashful's Fort. Yup, the most not safe for work level of all time. Yup, we can now go in here. <laughs> I think there's our final flower in here. Ooh, it's a bonus area! Oh, Boo Balloon, no, you don't! No, you don't! Yeah, they get kind of angry, and eventually you pop them. And then, yeah, in the case of that one, you can get a switch from it. Blindfolded Boo, they can only, I mean, they only come after you when they hear you. So if you're moving, ah! So if you're moving slowly, they won't, they won't bug you. Or, or if you're stopping in place, they won't bug you. It's when, they're, when you're moving, that'll kind of cause you ire. And wait a second, did I get all, oh, I did get all the flowers, okay. I thought that I didn't have all the flowers. Okay, okay. I guess I miscounted. <laughs> Anything in here? No, no. Does this have another... Whoops. Does this have another... I said. Does this have another exclamation point switch? Yes, it does. You can continue your bonusing twice before you leave the area, I suppose. Which makes sense, because this sure doesn't seem like you have enough time to get as anywhere close to all the coins in that time you're allowed. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, blind- uh oh, I, I, I've disturbed the boo. I've disturbed- okay, we're good. We're good. Run, 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 yeah! <laughs> Alright. We should be getting a midpoint soon, so I don't have to worry about my star count, just as long as I don't take a hit from the boss. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Alright, there's our midpoint. Now you get a little tutorial on these, I guess you could say fan blade like things. Yeah, you just kinda just kinda yeah, you run on them. You can also run right off them. Oops! I didn't I didn't mean to do that in, as improperly as I did. But yeah, I thought there was actually something safe down there. <laughs> it doesn't matter though, I just lost one life. But yeah, just just make sure that you stay on them, and if you're, if you're not touching anything, you'll be able to stay on them indefinitely. So just just relax and have a good time on these. You also notice that you always stay on the same portion of it, depending. I mean, no matter how close it looks like you are from the center, unless you're already at the center. So it's like the perspective is completely off on these. <laughs> like I should be getting smaller going in the background. Now you should be getting bigger coming into the foreground, but no, 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 that's not how it works. I stay the same size, and the block just sort of kind of has these edges that roll over. <laughs> I mean, yeah, just never mind. <laughs> I got my midpoints, I'm ready to go face the boss. Hmm. Oh, it's looming. It's looming. Yeah, it's just a regular boo. <laughs> Oh yes! We have Baby Mario's brother at Bowser's Castle! But we're not handing him over to the likes of you! Wow! And sure enough, we get the boss! And it doesn't look all that big yet. But when you do the deflection shot that I taught you on the other booze, it gets bigger. And bigger. And bigger. <laughs> That's the idea of the boss. It takes a- oh shoot! It takes up as much as the room, uh, much of the room as possible. You know why I said, oh shoot? Because in bosses, you can't use your items. <laughs> Alright, looks like I gotta restart. Come on, Toadies, just, just take, just take the baby. I know there's a lot of, a lot of time to knock down here, but it's, it's gotta be done. <laughs> oh shoot, I didn't mean to do that. All right, here, just give me, give me a hit there. There we go, nice and good. Yeah, you can go through its body safely when it's, when it's all super shy, but when it's uh, looking solid, nope. So you could actually do stuff like this if you wanted to pass right through it and get over to the other side. So yeah, it's not, not really any sort of big deal of a boss. I'd say that the bats, 
are more of a big deal than the bigger boo is. Because the, the fangs, they just keep popping in over and over and over, and you don't know where they're going to be popping in from. So, if you're being chased by the boo, you could be kind of led into a sort of kind of trapped situation. Alright. Redo! Wee! Alright, that sounds more like Toad than Kemek. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Yeah, take that, you monstrosity. I guess I could use... Oh, I didn't think about that! I guess I could bounce my eggs twice off the walls to recover stars if I need to. Oh, what a waste! What a waste of time! I didn't think about that for some reason. Yeah, take that. Yeah, take that. Yeah, take that. Yeah, take that! And I win. <laughs> Just as long as you fill it full of eggs, it'll be done pretty dang quickly. Woo! And remember, our stars are at 30 when we hit that midpoint, so there wasn't any worries about uh, me not being full of stars. Uh, that's why I didn't bother to check my inventory or anything like that. Success! Woo! Game show announcer hosts voice. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when Lakitu, or Lakitu, however you want to pronounce it, makes a debut, and it'll be quite dangerous. Also tricky to get it 100%, you'll see. <laughs>